Hey beautiful people, it's your girl Ty, and today I will be doing a haul for you guys. And it's been a while since I did my first haul, because I got like so little bit of things, but now I have, you know, a list of things to go through today, and I've just been ordering stuff on top of stuff, so without further ado, let me stop talking, and let's get started. Okay, so the first things that I ordered was some makeup, so I'm going to go through those really fast. I ordered these from ColourPop, and I also did like a little mini Ulta thing. I went to Ulta and got a couple things, so. Alright, so the first thing I have here is a highlighter from ColourPop, and it is Butterfly Beach. And it looks like this. Now, Butterfly Beach is like a soft peach, but it also has like gold and silver highlights in it. Let me tilt my camera down a little bit so you guys can see. So I'm just gonna, I'm just getting this today. It's like a cream to powder finish and it looks like amazing. So I'm gonna swatch this for you guys. That is beautiful. So this is what it looks like, it's very shiny, like I said it's a soft peach with some gold and silver accents in it and it gives like a nice almost golden finish, it's so beautiful, I love it. And I have not tried these out yet, like I said I have just ordered these and they came in today. Okay so my next highlighter is Lunch Money, also by Colourpop. And it comes like this. Kind of can't really tell because my light is like shining in it. And Lunch Money is a soft gold with a golden chrome finish. So looks like that. Let me swatch it for you. Okay, so this is Lunch Money right here. You can see the difference between Butterfly Beach and Lunch Money. Lunch Money is more crystallized, I want to say. It gives off like this more silvery tone, almost. It has some gold tones in it, but I would say it's more like on the champagne-y side, like the champagne-y gold, and it's really pretty. And the last highlight, uh, highlighter that I got was Monster. Now Monster, I'm like so prepared to like use these highlighters. Like I'm, I'm geeked, <laughs> like I'm geeked over these. And Monster is like a light pinky color. It looks like that. It's like light pink. And I'll show you its true color. And it has like an opal-y kind of finish, and it's so adorable. It's like very... Oh, this is so pretty. Oh my god. It's a very light pink. There it is. It's like pinky. Very cute. And I do have like some... I am part Native American. I don't know how much of a part Native American I am, but I have red tones to my skin. So like, I already have like a rosy kind of glow in my cheeks. So like this pink, like Monster would just bring it all out for me. Like, <sighs> praise the Lord. <laughs> like this stuff is amazing. And I'm very excited to use these. Now next, what I got from ColourPop was two matte lips, and I am so excited to show you guys these colors because I have been waiting to get these colors. So the first color I got was Instigator, and Instigator is, well it comes like this, and it's an ultra matte lip, and it is a peachy nude, so I'm going to show that to you guys. So this is how it looks on. This is Instigator. It's a very peachy nude color. Like it's literally a peach color. So it's true to form and I love it. I would prefer to wear a lip liner with it. I do not have one right now, but I like the color. I like it a lot. Um, get a little closer there for you. 
I think it's a really nice color if I do my makeup. Um, I do not have on any makeup at all right now. Fix my camera there. Okay, yeah, so I do not have on any makeup at all right now, as you can kind of tell. Um, and I really do like this color, so once again, this is Instigator. Make sure you put a moisturizer on before you use any of their matte, you know, because they will dry your lips out, like legit, like your lips will dry out. <laughs> like they'll feel like they're dry, like it won't come off. But if you use a moisturizer, like it'll enhance the look and your lips won't be like extra cracked or dry or whatever. So, yeah. Okay, so the next color I'm going to be showing you for my ultra matte lip is Guess. Ooh, I'm so excited to put this on. Guess is this blackened violet color, and I think it is so, so pretty. Like, with the right lip liner, and maybe if you don't even want to wear it matte and you want to put, like, a gloss over it, girl, get you some Guess. Like, this is about to be so lit. All right, so I'm going to show you how it looks on. Okay, so this is Guess. I just put on... And this is an ultra matte lip and it is completely dry. I'm going to bring a close up. And I absolutely love, love, love this color. Oh my God. Like, I love it matte. I would love it if it had like some, a little bit of gloss on it. Maybe do like an ombre kind of lip with like a, I don't know, blue color, you know, experiment as you will. But this color is absolutely amazing. Like I could wear this every day. And once again, I'm not wearing any kind of makeup whatsoever. I'm just wearing glasses and some hoops. Um, but yeah, this color is so lit right now. Like I am in love already and I just got this today. So I suggest that you get this color because I really, really, from the bottom of my heart, recommend this color. It is amazing. It is, it's true to its form, matte, completely matte. And once again, please do moisturize before putting anything on your lips. I just use like a dab of Vaseline, you know, it's as simple as that. But if you want to get there, I think they have um, a lippy kind of primer that you can put on before putting on these ultra matte, ultra satin lips, whatever you get from their product line. But I just use a dab of Vaseline. <laughs> dab. Alright, joke's over. <laughs> but yeah, this is an amazing, amazing color and I am so in love with it. So I will move on to my next products with this lipstick still on. Okay, so my next products that I will be showing you guys, I got from Ulta. I only got a couple things because Ulta was a little high for my pockets at the moment. So I just got these two things and they are from Too Faced. They were by Too Faced. And I got Melted Chocolate. And this is a liquefied long wear lipstick and it is in the color chocolate cherries and i will swatch this for you guys so that you can see what it looks like okay so here is chocolate cherries by Too faced now this is a really really pretty color it actually i think it compares to ColourPop's lax except it doesn't like matte it's not matte at all and it comes like this in this little tube here it is like the cutest packaging ever and it has like this velvety kind of felt tip like applicator so it just glides on smoothly I absolutely love 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 this color and yeah and my next product that I got is Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. I am in love with this mascara, you guys. Like, it is better than sex. <laughs> Believe me, this is, yes. It is in the color black and 
pretty sure that's the color yeah and it comes like this now like the grooves in this brush is like why why do you have to be so lit about it like it has like this nice little dip so like it gets every single lash like I will show you guys how my lashes look before and after so these are my lashes my lashes are pretty long they're not too shabby so these are my lashes before and here are my lashes after using better than sex I did my top and my bottom lashes so I think you guys can tell the difference like this mascara really brings out my lashes like I've gotten compliments and people have asked me are you wearing fake lashes no boo these are my real lashes they're like oh my god like how and sometimes I use an eyelash curler because literally like as you can see like my eyelashes go like straight out bro and they'll curl out you know when I use mascara but like sometimes I have to use, uh, use an eyelash curler and I do wear um, false lashes sometimes you know I just gotta be in the mood for them you know cuz I don't always like go out like every night you know but yeah back to my nerdy self okay so now that the makeup portion is out of the way I got some products that are for your face basically for your face for your skin and to start off I got activated charcoal now you're like what in the world is activated charcoal but what I was looking up recently was how to remove whiteheads and blackheads from your skin if you have like acne prone skin or you just get a lot of whiteheads and blackheads like in this area I know I do I get like hella whiteheads like around my nose area and like under my chin and stuff so I looked up a specific mask that removes blackheads and whiteheads and it involves using activated charcoal and some non-toxic school glue like the the drippy kind of glue not stick glue do not use stick glue for that um, and you make a mask out of it you just mix these two together and this is by Viva Doria Health, Healthy Living <laughs> Viva Doria Healthy Living activated charcoal absorbs a variety of toxic substances so if you mix two toxic things together that could never be good but this is this does have toxic substances but it helps you know remove those toxic things from your face like blackheads and whiteheads and stuff and it's just a quick way to remove it just make a mask with some glue it does hurt and I have done a mask on my face and I will be making a video um, doing that mask for you guys so I, I ordered this off of Amazon and it was about eight dollars inexpensive for my budget at least it was inexpensive and I will be showing you guys a video of me using this stuff next I got some Shea Moisture African Black Soap baby now this is the magical stuff right here African Black Soap is like life it is like a breath of fresh air I love this stuff so I'm gonna show you guys just what it is literally it's black soap literally it is a bar of black soap and it has like the shea butter kind of like crumbs in them to like exfoliate your face you can't really see but like they have like little pores in them and they have like little shea butter like crumbs and they exfoliate your face i literally just take the bar wet it when i'm like in the shower and i just scrub it all over my face so this is like the holy grail right here and I absolutely absolutely love it and yeah that is enough of this product moving on 
Okay, so I forgot to say where I got this from. So the Shea Moisture African Black Soap I got from GNC Wellness, but you can get it from any drugstore, Walmart, Target, Walgreens, Rite Aid. I'm pretty sure that they have it in stock or in the store. Shea Moisture is, you know, international used product. So yeah, I'm sorry I forgot to say that. But my next product, I went to Trader Joe's to get and it is my Trader Joe's Tea Tree Tingle Conditioner. Boom. It, it did, now this is the holy grail for my hair. Like my hair is like so, so thick. Like it's like long and thick and like it's, it's doing too much as you can see. Like it's literally, my head is full of hair. And uh, this helps to detangle like anything that you know is messing up in my head which is like beautiful because <sighs> girl if you have hair like this then you know the struggle you really do but this conditioner contains peppermint tea tree and eucalyptus botanicals so this is this is the good stuff right here and I've only used literally that much of it so far and this is how long the bottle is and I've only used that much you don't really need a lot like a little goes a long way with this bottle and I believe this cost about eight dollars at Trader Joe's um, I got this from and it, it literally does wonders tea tree oil is good like it just takes all of the the badness like it just soaks up all the dirt the grime and it just it strips it strips your hair but it also gives it back that kind of life because it has tea tree oil in it and it it's strong has a very strong smell like literally you just can't get over that peppermint peppermint smells so good to me like in love and another thing that I got from Trader Joe's was tea tree oil <laughs> so tea tree oil this is a hundred percent tea tree oil from Australia it's lit um, and I use this for my nose piercing now you'll be like girl what do you need tea tree oil for your nose piercing for look so if you have a nose piercing then you will understand that you get like keloids or they call it hypertrophic scarring as I explained to you guys in my other video if you have not checked it out I will link it in the description below and it was an update on my nose piercing but hypertrophic scarring or keloids is another word for it appears on your nose ring let me bring the camera a little closer I no longer have a keloid it's literally just straight up ring to nose action <laughs> like literally my keloid was like the same size as my nose ring unacceptable I know but what the tea tree oil did what the tea tree oil did was it dried out the keloid and then it shrunk it and I was like whoa I wasn't expecting it to work but like as soon as I got the tea tree oil I was in love like the keloid disappeared from my face and it was too lit for my own good like literally and I absolutely love it literally just take a q-tip dab it in some dab, dab the q-tip into the little jar with the, the with the oil and you know rub it around you know where the keloid is you know you don't have to do any extreme measures and take it out or whatever no need like it'll just shrink it and it's gone so like I'm happy with my nose piercing as of right now it's not annoying me it was annoying when I had the keloid and when it was hurting and you know but that's a whole nother video so moving on to my next product okay so I ordered a product off of Amazon and it is this stay foot mesh trainer it is a waist trainer it looks like this it is very big and it is by stay foot and it is a Chinese 
um, institution and they, you know, have waist trainers. And I am in love with this one because as you can see, it has these little air holes in them so that you can breathe, which is beautiful. I don't really, I don't dig the latex waist trainers because they, it just looks like you can't breathe at all. And I love how this works because I just go to the gym, you know, slip this on, head to the gym. I can breathe. I can sweat without, like, dying. <laughs> and this was about, I want to say $14. It was inexpensive. I know that much. So if you look it up on Amazon, it's Stay Foot Mesh Waist Trainer. It should be around that price, 12 to $14. It's very inexpensive and I absolutely love it. So I recommend this, highly recommend it. And my very last product is some Dr. Shows, girl, cause if you got some smelly feet problems that you need to take care of, then this is the stuff for you. This is the Dr. Shows Odor X Odor Fighting Spray Powder with sweat max technology it is lit literally all you do is spray it on your feet like if you're gonna wear some shoes without no socks girl and you know i know we have those days where oh, i'm gonna wear these leggings but i don't want to wear socks with these shoes because my socks don't match or you know you just don't want to wear socks in general spray this it has like a little twisty knob on it so you turn it like that and then you spray it on your feet and the little nooks and crannies where you know the funk shall appear and you know you just spray it on your feet put your feet in your shoes and you'll be good all day and this is I am living proof like I used to have feet problems like going through middle school and high school with being a dancer and being in musical theater and running around a lot and doing shows like five days in a row type kind of deal and you know I had to wear the same shoes every night right so like my feet would be banging after a show and then I would have to keep washing my shoes and washing my shoes it was not my shoes girl it was my feet so this has been the holy grail since I was about 10, 11 years old. So I would suggest getting you some of this girl because it's lit. And that is all for my haul today, guys. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Please like, comment, and or subscribe if you are new to my channel. And please recommend this channel to other people, your friends, your family. And you know, I give out tips and hair tips, health tips, makeup tips. I will try to do more videos going along through the summer. I will be working, which makes it hard as you know, working Monday through Friday like you know nine to five type job is like killer killer so I will definitely try and get videos up to you guys every week I will really try my hardest to update you guys on what's going on and um yeah that is all for this video guys I really hope you enjoyed it like comment and or subscribe and I will see you guys in my next video peace